What is going on, my homies? Bleaker here, and today we are back with another episode. Today. Why do I say today? Why are we back today? We are back with another episode of the Journey for the Enchanted Crest RPG. Where we left off, left off last time, we just cleared a color puzzle, I think, for lack of a better term. Sure, a color puzzle. We just cleared the color puzzle. Color puzzle. And we're about to clear the next particular puzzle. Which is a pain in the butt. But on the bright side, I remembered why I need arrows. Did that do something? That did something. The room is going to flood. Now, this m puzzle is fairly weird. And if this is where you guys are getting stuck, I can imagine why. Let me know, like, where you guys are getting stuck on these so I can, um, if the playthrough is enough, I can walk you through, I can actually walk you through, through, uh, comment, through the comment section. Now, this puzzle is very strange, and I can see why you guys are getting stuck here. Oh, hurry up and fill up this water room. Come on. There we go. Raise the water level. Yes, that's what we need to do still. Flame grilled chicken. Yes, please. Is this something? No, that's completely unimportant. I might need the TNT. I'm not going to need this chest key anymore. Every shake I'm going to need. I really need to clear that out. Fruit juice. Probably not going to need that, but I will gladly take it. There we go. So, there's a button over here. Lever button. Oh, there we go. Down here. I didn't even see that chest before. That's awesome. That's awesome. I didn't even know that chest was there. Huh. Ah, lever. Now our now the water level back in that cave is completely full, so that'll allow us access to the second level of this particular puzzle. Plus, there's also water guardians, cause why not? But I'm not dealing with those. I hate those. I think they're completely unfair. Now this puzzle right here got me for like ten minutes, cause I was looking over here for buttons, when in reality. You need to turn around. This wall is cracked. I didn't realize that. I don't know if it was the because I was using the default texture pack or if I was using what I was doing. I must have been on some serious form of drugs. Like, all the meth. All of it. All of the meth at the same time. How I didn't realize this? No. No. LSD. LSD. For all of your hallucinogenic natures. There's the kaboom! There's the huge earth-shattering kaboom! Red power block. Now we're talking. I have the power! He-Man! Guardians of the Galaxy. No, the He-Man Master of the Universe. I used to watch the hell out of that as a kid. Although I had no clue what I was really watching. All I knew is it was weird. And I don't remember anything. All I know was, I have the power! He man, and that's it. I also used to watch a lot of Dragon Ball. Oh, um, welcome to the boss room. That was a lot faster than I remembered. I thought there was another puzzle. Okay, shoot. Hello. I think this is the boss. Well, it is now. Killing all of the dirt blocks at once. Oh, this is the dirt boss. Oh, this is the dirt boss. Okay, 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 okay. Now I'm with him. I like this music. I think this is part of the mic. Kill him, kill him, my minions. Oh! Jesus Christ! Dirt boss. My... Which one is the real dirt? I think this is the dirt boss. 
Doesn't matter. Killing minions. Oh, I beat the dungeon. Yay. Let's have a strawberry shake in celebration. Save your glass bottles, too. I don't want to teleport out of here yet. Hey, cool. The green orb. I think it's the last orb, actually. I had the three orbs. Now I can get the enchanted crest. But where is it? Maybe this book has a clue. Well, I left the green orb here in the chest after all my efforts. I cannot possess the three orbs. I know this now. I am not even a knight, even though I can hold the green one and the red one and even the blue one I cannot hold or possess three at the same time. I did find out though that the enchanted crest if it is not a myth is hidden in the cemetery the semen the, the cemetery the, the cemetery hmm the only cemetery I know is the gravel cemetery near market town I will need it to get a shovel from the mystery house on 10 mile island before I can Enter the cemetery. And a crow's concoction. Cool, let's get the hell out of Dodge. So that concludes the moldy dungeon, guys. In the next episode, I'm going to take you to the mystery dungeon. Or the mystery house. Yes, we're going to go to the mystery house. And in that episode, I'm going to take you to the graveyard. And yeah, we'll clear the mystery house and go to the graveyard. And I will show you guys the location of that. So uh, hang tight for the next episode. In the meantime, I'm going to go and seriously do some inventory management. I need to go to Market Town. I just need to do some very serious inventory management. So um, stick around, guys, for the next episode. Make sure you guys leave some likes, subscribe, drop some comments, communicate with me. I seem like I'm a pretty funny guy. I don't show it very frequently during my walkthroughs. I try and be funny, but it's really hard to like solo commentary. Like, you guys don't know how hard this is for me to, like, keep talking. Teller's house. Oh, I don't need to go there anymore. Pen and teller. But, uh, so the next episode, I'll go to the mystery house. I will introduce you guys to the graveyard, but then I'm going to stop there. And the one after that, we'll begin clearing that dungeon. And we're going to get some good stuff out of there. Trust me, that we're going to get some of the best loot in the game out of there, if I remember correctly. Hopefully I remember correctly. I probably don't, though, because... It's been a little bit here. So, um, guys, thank you once again. This has been the best series I've ever done, and I think that's entire and I know that's entirely thanks to you guys putting up with my shenanigans. But this is all the time I have for now. Thank you guys. This has been Bleaker. Be seeing you. <laughs>